Hi, 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 guys! So welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Jem Casarias. I'm a registered nurse in the Philippines, in the UK, and we are here in America. So welcome to my vlog. Hey, 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 guys! How are you guys? I miss y'all. I miss y'all. Tell me more about you guys. How are you? I haven't posted in in ages. I think almost a month. The last time I've, I've posted a video and it's about Christmas, if I'm not mistaken. And here I am. Um, happy 2024. I know January has been a long month for us, but here, here we are. And um, yeah, how are you? How's your NCLEX? How's your OET, IELTS? Um, Oski, how's it? Tell me more about you. Nabis ko kayo. Talagang parang ang tagal natin hindi nakita. Look at my little cute tulip cup, right? So, anyway, uh, for today's video, we are in the mood to do video. Um, we're gonna talk about the elephant in the room. Hi! The elephant in the room. Look at that. <laughs> it's gonna be my monthly um, salary and my salary range here in America. So I know you guys are excited. You've been asking me about my cost of living here, my monthly expenses. And here you go, guys. Let's do this. Oh, before I begin, please don't forget to like my vid. Please don't forget to like and subscribe to my YouTube channel and click the notification bell to get notified whenever I release a new video. Okay, let's go for a fit check. Um, Lululemon, Lululemon. Um, trousers is for a mini clo, A6, and we're good to go. So we are here in Gre we are here inside Greta. So um, like I've said, today's a video we are going to talk about um, my monthly expense says here in my salary range okay but before that let me give you a disclaimer okay um disclaimer is that number one i'm single i don't have a child back in the philippines i don't have that much responsibility so um yeah so whatever expense i have it is going to be with it is going to be for me for my future and for my family so that's number one number two um i'm currently here in texas um there's no income tax there, there's no income tax here um only federal tax and of course sales tax and number three um cost of living and per uh, re, and your per rate our per rate is different from state to state so yeah so those are my disclaimers uh, all right so um let's talk about my salary range okay if i don't pick up an extra shift my salary range is between five thousand eight hundred to five thousand nine hundred per month well um that is net income nah i'm about net income and if i pick up at least three to four shifts in a month which i'm currently doing um that's why i haven't posted you know video because i've been busy i'm a workaholic girl so um my salary range is between seven thousand five hundred dollars to almost eight thousand um dollars per per month so yeah so those so that is my salary base salary and if i picked up uh, an extra shift so yeah are you guys happy diba? are you guys excited um so i'm not wearing my contact lens because i'm gonna get it and um, if you see me like frowning while driving yeah and also 
don't judge my driving skills because I'm still new here, let me tell you. So we are already we are already here in America's best contacts and eyeglasses. So we're gonna pick it up very soon. So let's talk about my monthly expenses. So we're gonna divide it into four categories. First, we call it big checks. Second, it's the, my retirement and savings. Third is my insurances, and fourth is miscellaneous. So let's chop it up later. Let me go and grab my contacts. I'll see you in a bit. Okay. Okay. So let's go to my first category. Big. I call it big checks because why? I spend most of my salary in there. Well, half of it. Um, first is, of course, my rent. I'm paying $1,500 per month. I'm living in an apartment. They call it luxury apartment because it has amenities and whatnot. And it's just basically less than five minutes um, from my work. Ganun siya kamahal or yeah. So that's it. That's $1,500 per month. It, that includes my $5,040 to be exact because my covered parking and also my water bill is included in there so, so yeah. the second big check is of course my greta i'm paying um 1096 dollars per month um she is a N nissan rogue um 2023 sv premium so zero apr for 36 months so the the earlier the better get on so so those are my big checks. So let's go to my retirement. So let's go to number two, which is my retirement and savings account. Okay, but before that, let's go to Starbucks. So as you've noticed, I removed my jacket. It's because it's it's getting hot in here in uh, in Texas, y'all. And yeah, um, well. So let's go to retirement and to my um, savings um, account. So basically, um, as I've told you earlier, what I'm getting is net income. So, um, but I'm t I'm gonna tell you how much I pay doon sa aking 401k, which is my raw, uh, which is the retirement account. Um, so I'm um, paying um, $180 per month, per, bi-weekly. So that's um, $360. And also, see, my employer also matches that um, money that I'm, you know, given or I'm whatever. So, um, so yeah. And then... I also started Roth IRA. Um, Roth IRA is um, individual retirement account. So the difference between 401k and Roth IRA, 401 is before tax and Roth IRA is after tax. So I've just um, recently um, um, open that account through um, Fidelity. You can choose either Vanguard or Fidelity. I'm currently using Fidelity and I'm putting um, $250 per month. So, yeah. So, let's go to my savings account or I call it high yield. They call it here high yield savings account. Basically, so yeah, I'm putting money um, at least 500 per cut off so that is 1000 per month so so bakit siya bakit malaki doon hindi na lang sa Roth IRA ang malaki and dun sa well i don't know 
you know that's why I'm I'm planning I'm I'm still um contemplating kung paano ko i-juggle yung mga kayamanan. Hoy, kayamanan. So, basta ganon. I can't put that money into um to my Roth IRA. Um but, you know, I'm still um kind of figuring it out how to do that or how to manage my money. So, but yeah. And then um what else? Actually, um yun lang. Yeah, actually yun lang for now. Um So yeah, um yun lang. Um yun lang ang for my retirement and savings account, basically 401k Um, Roth IRA and my high yield um, savings account. Um, Hello, thank you for choosing Starbucks. How can I help you today? Yeah, hi. Um, can I get a venti ice matcha latte with oat milk? That'll be all. Okay, that'll be six ninety eight at the window. Thank you. Thank you. Can I get inside? We never go out of style. We never go out of style. I know I'm good. Thank you. You have a good one. You know, kind of lately, I really love um, matcha. So I don't know why. I kind of like it. We can back every time. We never go out of style. We never go out of style. The long hair, my t-shirt. So where were we? Um, like I've said, um, renters. So here are my insurances. First is my car insurance. I'm paying two hundred four dollars per month. It's kind of high, maybe because I'm a new driver here in America. Second is renter's insurance. I paid it annually. Um, I paid 300 ish, dollars per. I mean per annual. So if we're gonna divide it into, into. Um, into woo, or if we're gonna divide it into 12 more or less thirty dollars per month um, and then what else my other insurance uh, annually I paid it like one hundred twenty dollars um, if we're gonna divide it into 12 let's say more or less ten dollars per month And then my medical insurance, um, I, I'm paying two hundred seventy-five dollars biweekly. So um, the thing here, the thing here in, in in America, there's a lot of insurance here. Unlike in Philippines, there's like PhilHealth, and once you're um, employee, you have this private insurance, right? And then in any in in the UK. You have have this NHS, so it's a free um, healthcare for for everyone. Here in America, it has a lot of um, different types of insurances. There's EQA, PPO, and um, 
HSA or health savings account. So the question is, what do you um, actually need? So for me, I'm a, sing I'm, a, I'm a single, I don't have dependent here in America. I don't have comorbidities. So that's why I chose health savings account. But you, if you have a family or if you want to travel, you might want to choose um, EQA or PPO. Um, but yeah, I'm paying $275 um, by, by, by weekly. So health savings account, basically para siyang savings for your health. Um, the maximum money that you can put into that per year, it's $4,000 sa, sa hospital ko. In my hospital, $4,000. But I didn't maximize it because I'm still juggling my finances here. Um, so yeah, those are my insurances recap car rental other insurance and my medical insurance okay so let's go to my miscellaneous um, my miscellaneous is basically my other um, expenses so first is let's go to my internet service I'm paying $35 per month unlimited internet streaming whatever you call it and then the second one is my mobile plan a t-mobile it's 87 dollars per month why it's kind of you know mahal it's because i bought like apple watch series so yon and um what else um yon yon perfect that is perfect. Right. Okay. Okay. So, um, okay. So, ayun, nasa gas allowance sa tayo, di ba? Ay, lamig na. Okay. That's a gas allowance sa tayo. So it's thirty to forty dollars per month. Ay hindi. Inu let no. So we're we're in grocery na. So grocery, it's one hundred to one hundred fifty dollars per month. Um, it depends on my needs and my wants. Talaga needs and wants ganon. And then, um, gas. Oh, my subscriptions. Let's say for all in all, I'm gonna say fifty dollars per month. Netflix, Hulu, um, what else? Netflix, Hulu. Um, I would say other streaming um, stuff. Apple Music. I don't have Spotify, but yeah. So that's fifty dollars per month. So again, gas allowance, um, T-Mobile, internet. I've said that. Grocery. I've said that. At um, ano yipis na ko subscription and in pinapatol ko sa Philippines or Philippine allowance. Um, it's just hundred. Oh no, two hundred to two hundred fifty dollars per month. Um, like I've said, hindi ako nagpapadala masyado. Um, I mean, wala akong, like I've said, so sa Philippines, I'm giving like uh, 200 to 250 dollars per month. Uh, fixed, ala fixed allowance ng aking dear lola, it's 200 to 250 dollars. Um, if they need something or if I like gusto kong ipagawa yung kusina namin or yung banyo or if I want to renovate something back home just get it from my high yield savings account and yeah so basically I'm saving my money here in America then pinapatalo ko sa Pilipinas you, you get what I'm saying I don't know maybe it's because if my money is with me I have more control you know over it. Gusto ko yung okay, may control. Why? 
Well, anyhow, well, is that it? Did I miss something for my miscellaneous? Again, gas, um, internet, um, T-Mobile plan, subscription, grocery, Philippines. I think that's it. Those are my um, miscellaneous. Hindi ko alam kung magkali natitira, but whatever yung matitira, sometimes I buy ones, and like sometimes I treat myself like Chick-fil-A, and um, what do you call it? Starbucks or Starbs. Did I miss something? So let's compute. Let's compute. Alam. So more or less, ang, ang more or less per month expense ko is four thousand seven hundred hundred fifty two dollars per month. Um, if I didn't pick up, let's say my av my my salary, um, average salary sa isang buwan, I I said like five thousand eight hundred, so minus. Five thousand eight hundred. So I still have one thousand na na sa akin. But if I pick up, let's say the average salary that I'm getting is like seven five, right? Minus four seven fifty two. So I'm still getting more or less two thousand. Para sa akin yon. Um, ano pa ginagawa ko doon? I don't know. Minsan nilalagay ko lang siya. Minsan, yeah. So more or less, may natitirang a thousand or two thousand dollars after all my 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 rent, my savings, and all those stuff. So yeah. So what do you think? Are you guys moving here or what? Shut up. So yeah, I hope um hindi magulo yung video ko. Kasi nag-drive tayo and I hope um, everything is good. So, um, thank you guys for watching and I'll see you soon.